Hey guys and girls and YouTubers and other weird people. I am AD Video Editor, although I am sure you guys knew that. And uh, once again, this is another video of my fantastic holiday present to you guys. In today's tutorial on Wednesday, December 11th, I will be going over Sony Color Match in, of course, Sony Vegas. This isn't one of my favorite effects, but I still feel like you guys should know about this effect and see if you can use it in your videos. So as usual, go to the video effects and go find color match and add it and OK. And what this effect does, it takes the colors from your source image, which is here, and applies them to your target image, which is here. So generally, you might you would want your target image to be your video preview, so you can have that because that's what you're going to see. So an easy way to do that is select capture well your target image from your preview. You can click that, and right away you see it appears. Then your source image, you can select a file, browse your computer for something. You can take a screenshot of any particular thing. You can use your, like, copy something and paste something, or you can also use your preview. And so, pretty much, you can take whatever colors from your source image, and it will automatically apply them to your target image. So, if I were to take a screenshot of my yellowish desktop here, you see it applies yellow to my target image and makes it yellow. But I could also take, like, this a screenshot like that and it makes it a little bit grayer because there's a lot of gray in there so I mean um, depending on what your source image is it can make your video can make your target image look pretty cool but me personally this effect isn't for me but if you guys can use this effect in your videos then this uh, then this tutorial would have been worth it and you can also adjust the strength of the color. So hold on, let me get back the yellow for my desktop. So when it's all the way up, my video is very yellow. But I can easily bring it down so it, it can be an in-between color. Or if it's at zero, there is like nothing applied to it. And you can also match the brightness. And when you click that, it will take the brightness from your source image and apply it to the brightness from your target image and uh, just change it to the way it was. However, with a solid color like this, it might be pretty boring. So that's why it might be helpful if you wanted to use a um, image to add a different color to it. So let's say when I went ahead to take this pterodactyl and I applied it. You see, it's not only green, but it also has that little bit of like orangish brown applied from the pterodactyl itself. And if I don't want the brightness to be completely changed, I can take match brightness off, and it just changes the colors. Here's another one. If I here's like trees and stuff there, the way it just applies it because it's not just green, even though there's mainly green in the image, but it takes all the colors and applies it over there. Well, guys, that was the color match effect in Sony Vegas. It was a pretty quick one, not so much to go over. You might want to do some practice with this, figure out what images can make your target image look good. But I'm just letting you know, this effect for me personally doesn't really work. But I would love to see you guys use this effect in your videos. Okay, well, please subscribe, like, um, and watch more of my tutorials. And, you know, I'm still looking out for those 300 views and 100 subscribers. And I know you guys really want the rewards from that. So come on guys, just watch and subscribe, not much to it, and I will see you tomorrow.